What is going on, you future crypto billionaires? My name's Brett. This is Be Extreme Crypto. What I want to do to uh, help you guys out today is I wanted to go over some things as far as investing in crypto. I know a lot of you are new to it out there. I've been new to it. Um, I was always a stock guy until a couple years ago, then uh, decided to get into it. And it took me a little while to catch on to what was going on in the in the space. But there's a few guys on YouTube that I've watched and learned from. And, uh, you know, I done the Twitter thing and that is scary. <laughs> there are some people out there that will lead you down the wrong path. So anything that you hear out there, you want to make sure and research yourself before you go and invest in your hard earned money into uh, these riskier assets. But what, what I've done today is I pulled up uh, coinmarketcap.com. Now, what you could do is you uh, can look up a ton of information on, on these projects that you're looking to invest in. Uh, what I've done today is I pulled up Polygonmatic. Uh, all you OGs out there, you, you know who Polygonmatic is, and probably even new people to the space know who they are. Them guys are rocking it nowadays. Um, they just started out like 2019, and they are landing some huge, huge contracts with some companies. But anyway, what you do is you go over to coinmarketcap.com, and you click in this search button right here, and it'll just throw out some coins right here but what what you'll do is you'll type in the name of the coin and then click search and you'll be able to pull it up what we have here is polygonmatic you can see where they have a link to their website which is very important anytime uh, you want to research a project you want to be able to go over to their website but anyway over here on this side is their current price now here's what we want to look at we want to look at what their market cap currently is. Down here is their market cap. They have a $10 billion market cap right now. So they're not a small crypto. They, they'd be considered like a blue chip in stocks. They're a little bit down, you know, as far as volume today. Uh, but their diluted market cap is up. And we want to go over here also to their max supply. Their max supply is 10 billion. Now, their total supply is also 10 billion. Now, this is very important. If you go research a project and they have something out there like 10 billion uh, for their max supply and their total supply is like 1 trillion, I, I personally would stay away from it. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not here to give you financial advice, but I'm just I'm just going with what has worked with me in the past, and I just don't want to see anyone get wrecked in this space. Um, so this has a hundred percent of the total supply out there. So you know they're not going to be able to dilute the price of the crypto by flooding it in with a bunch of extra crypto. Uh, because once you do that, let's say you have a trillion out there and your max supply that's out there right now is only a, a 10 billion. They throw the rest of that in there. It's going to crash price like you wouldn't believe. So anyway, make sure and look at that. Now, let's look at their past. See if we can find it here. Okay, here's their 24 hour, hour volume. Now, I'm, I'm doing this, of course, on a computer. You could do this on your phone as well. It's uh, going to be laid out a little differently. But uh, their current rank is number eight. So they're in the top 10. Uh, here's their market cap. We already went over that. Now, we want to see their all time high. Their all time high was $2.92. Right now, they're currently sitting at $1.10. So that's almost a 3x to their all-time high. Now, I personally, with all the things that's going on with this with this project, I could I personally think that they'll they'll do anywhere from an 8 to 10x on this next bull run. Now, 
the Bitcoin having and until around spring of 2024. So we still got about a year before the having. And then usually within that year after that is the uh, bull run. Anyway, just going over those little things there. Uh, now let's go on back up here to the top. Up here are explorers. You could go over their poly scan, check on that. You could go over to their website, which I highly recommend. Now here's another thing. You could go to their Twitter community, their Reddit community, and you want to see if they're being active, staying active with their people over there uh, on Twitter or wherever. Because usually if you have an active community, uh, you usually have a lot of support behind you. And there's a good chance that in the next bull run, they're, they're going to do pretty well. Um, here is their white paper. Now, this is very important. You could go over here. Well, for some odd reason, the page ain't found, but so it just took me over to Polygon's site. Um, you also want to check out who the de develops are, developers are. You want to check out on the team, uh, the resources. Let me see here. Okay, there's a document. Another thing is, a lot of these meme coins out here, uh, this isn't a meme coin, but if you notice, a lot of these meme coins, when they uh, link you to their website, you'll go to their team and you'll see monkeys and then they'll put Steve underneath. You know, that that's not fully doxed. So how can you trust a project if they're not going to fully dox their team? You know, these are just some basics for today. I just wanted to make a short video. This is actually my first video I've been on camera. Uh, the other, I, I used some AI and just threw it up there for fun. But uh, if there's anything that you would like to add to this to help anyone in the crypto community, please put some comments down below. And I also wouldn't mind uh, chatting back, with, uh, back and forth with you on some things uh, as far as doing research as well. Um, that's about all I got to say. Like and share this video. If you have any questions, comments, or anything, please make sure and leave a comment down below. Thanks.